Hi everyone and thanks for checking in to Weatherbug. Todd Nelson with a look at your National Coast to Coast forecast. And we're talking about changing seasons. I always like as we get closer to fall, you have this colder air building up closer to the Arctic regions and the North Pole. And as it happens, you tend to whip up more uh, of these stronger storms. And that can range from severe weather to even snowfall, kind of like what you see in the spring. But uh, we had some reports of water spouts across the coastal communities from late last week and into this weekend. And then some snowfall uh, last week as well from the Colorado Rockies, even into uh, portions of uh, the northern Rockies and uh, beyond. Uh, but the tropics, very quiet for now. Nothing brewing in the central Atlantic, nor do we have anything brewing in the Gulf of Mexico. Might see a little wave try to develop and shift over Florida, which would help to bring additional heavy rainfall. But look at these uh, rainfall tallies into the next five days. The coastal communities of Texas look to be fairly quiet. And then we have some heavier rainfall across of Florida, maybe two to three or four inches of rain through this upcoming week. Nothing developing here in the eastern Pacific either. It is all quiet there. We have some moisture, though, lifting through the Rockies. And this is due to an upper-level low spinning around. It's pretty uh, interesting to see that on water vapor. There it is, a kind of clockwise circulation. On the western side of that low, it is cooler this morning. But yesterday on the eastern side of it, we had wind and hail. And uh, this morning, picking up some snowfall across the higher elevations once again. This elongated low will help to keep things rather cool along the front range of the Rockies. A little bit warmer out ahead of it today in the middle Mississippi Valley in the central part of the country, but it's not going to bring a terrible amount of warming with that. Our future cast shows the storm kind of fizzling out, maybe bringing a little more rain to the Tennessee Valley in the southeast as it, as it approaches that area for the end of the week here. But again, really today, pretty quiet.